Hey guys, it's Savannah and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for being here with me today. If you guys haven't already, please go ahead and click on the subscribe button down below for more videos like this. And don't forget to also tap on the notification bell as well so you guys will never miss out on an uploaded video. If you guys haven't already, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. I am SLIT on Instagram and Twitter and then Dear Savannah on Snapchat. All that information can be found right here for you guys. And yes, let's just go ahead and get on started with today's video. So the reason why I am making today's video my top five favorite volumizing mascaras is because last week I asked you guys to leave me some questions for a Q&A that I will be filming this week. And one that I got over and over and over again was my favorite volumizing mascara. So instead of prolonging the Q&A video, I decided to make a separate video regarding all of my favorite volumizing mascaras. So that's what this video is going to be all about. And yeah, let's just go ahead and get on started. So to start off, none of these mascaras are going to be in any particular order. I don't like one more than the other per se. I'm just going to go in a random order. So I'm going to start with the L'Oreal Miss Manga Rock Mascara. I have it in the waterproof formula. Um, I haven't done a Mascara Madness Monday on this yet, but I do really like the L'Oreal Miss Manga collection. I feel like all the mascaras from this collection, they're really volumizing um, and very dramatic as well. So I have the Miss Manga Rock, and when I was using this, this one is a little bit dried out already, but when I was using this, I did really like it. It was very volumizing and I liked the waterproof formulation to use as my first coat. The next mascara I'm going to be talking about is the CoverGirl Plumpifying Waterproof Mascara. I recently did a Mascara Madness Monday on this, so I will link it down below. Any of the mascaras that have a Mascara Madness Monday, I will go ahead and link it down below and then also card it up here for you guys when I am talking about it. So if you guys wanted to watch it later, the link will be readily available for you guys but I did really enjoy this mascara if you guys will go watch the mascara madness Monday I did on this um, the demo just demonstrates how amazingly beautiful it lengthens and volumizes my lashes in that video one thing about this mascara though that I do touch base a little bit in the mascara madness Monday video is that the brush is rather large so if you're not a huge fan of a really, really big brush on a mascara, you will probably not like this. The next mascara I absolutely adore. I featured it in so many of my videos already, but I can't stop talking about it because it is just simply amazing. I am talking about the Maybelline Lash Sensational Full Fan Effect Mascara. I have it in the non-waterproof formula, and I love, love, love using this as my second coat mascara. It just gives me instant volume, instant drama, and it is just so beautiful. It just makes my lashes look like false lashes and it just does it so effortlessly. I highly, highly, highly recommend you guys checking out this mascara if you haven't already. The next two mascaras I'm going to be talking about are going to be high-end mascaras. So the first one is going to be the YSL The Shock Mascara. It is not my favorite favorite overall YSL mascara, but it is amazing at volumizing your lashes. I feel like the YSL The Shock and then the Maybelline Lash Sensational, they kind of do the same thing for me. So if you're on a budget, I would just stick with the Lash Sensational, you'll get the same effect. But if you do want to be adventurous and try out a high-end mascara, I do recommend the YSL The Shock Mascara. It just gives you instant volume, it's beautiful, it doesn't flake on me, it's just absolutely gorgeous, especially as a layering mascara. And the next mascara I have to share with you guys, I don't have the full size of currently, but I have bought it and repurchased it and used it so many times. I've talked about it on my channel before, it is the Chanel Le Volume Mascara. I have kind of like the sample size here. Um, for you guys to see, but it is just an instant volumizing mascara. This will give you dramatic lashes with one coat, and I absolutely love it. I love, love, love using this as a second coat mascara. It is gorgeous. I've recommended this to my mom, to my cousins, and they've all loved it. So that is going to sum it up for my top five volumizing mascaras. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have any other mascara questions or video requests, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below. I would love to hear from you guys. Also, don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you guys will never miss on an uploaded video. And if you guys haven't already, don't forget to also follow me on my other social medias, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. I am SLET on Instagram and Twitter, and Dear Savannah on Snapchat. I would love to talk to you guys over there. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe because it would make me very happy and my heart all fuzzy, and thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, guys!